think we want something like that, but with black hardware. Just like, let's just take it in. This is beautiful. But I did get swatches for our dining banquet. This might be the most expensive thing I've ever seen at Home Goods. We are well on our way to furnishing our new house. Hello everyone, what is up and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hi, my name is Katie. I live in Orlando. I make all shopping and shop with me videos, home decor and home decorating videos. I love shopping at all my favorite stores like Target, TJ Maxx, Home Goods, Kirkland's, World Market, stores like that to show you what is new. Any sales or clearance deals I think you may want to be aware of and tons of seasonal decor. We did also just move into a brand new house so I have kind of a whole like moving series going on right now and that has been a big focus on on my channel lately. Today is no different. I'm sure you can tell by like the title and the thumbnail. Today we are shopping for the new house. So we're actually gonna be going to West Elm Pottery Barn as well as Home Goods. So Home Goods, you'll be seeing a lot on my channel because every single store has different stuff. And I'm going to a Home Goods today that I haven't been to in a really long time. So I'm excited to see what they have. I also will be stopping by West Elm and Pottery Barn, which are more high-end furniture stores. But I do think that we will be getting a few pieces of furniture from those stores. So I kind of want to poke around, see if they have the items that we're interested in potentially in store, and maybe get some fabric swatches. And I can always show those to you guys on this video if you want to. I have gotten a bunch of requests to do more high-end stores like West Elm and Pottery Barn. We will see if Pottery Barn works out. I actually did try to film a video at Williams Sonoma around Christmas time and they stopped that right away and told me to get out. So I don't know if Pottery Barn's gonna work out but I really 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 hope so. I'll try to get any clips that I can in there. But yeah I'm super excited to finally hopefully see some of the furniture pieces in person because Furniture is really expensive and it takes a long time to come, so we want to make sure that we definitely want the stuff that we think that we want. We also want to look at lighting fixtures. Well, I say we, but it's just me today, but Brian and I are interested in, in looking for like pendant lights from West Elm and stuff, so super excited. That is what we are up to today. I hope that you guys are excited to see what is new at West Elm Pottery Barn and what we find today at Home Goods. But if you're excited, please be sure to give the video a big thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button down below. Only like 40% of the people who watch my videos regularly have made sure that they hit the subscribe button. So just double check down below that you hit the subscribe button. And if you want, you can also hit the notification bell and YouTube will notify you every single time I post a new video. I do post four times a week on Monday, Tuesday, Friday, and Saturday. Tons of DIY home makeovers coming up. Lots of shopping videos. Those are definitely not going anywhere. So if that interests you, definitely make sure you subscribe. But if you're excited for me to get going, then that is good because it's finally time. Let's head into the first store, which is West Elm, and see if they have anything that I want to get. I'm so excited. I haven't been here in so long, and they do have such cute stuff. Like, just right when you walk in. Goals. Not stuff I would think to pick, which is, like, that's why I love coming into stores and actually, like, seeing stuff. These light fixtures. Oh, my God. How cute would that be for above the island? I'm going to be taking so many pictures and sending it to Brian. But yeah, this whole store is just like goals. Like wait till we get over there. That's like what dreams are made of. Just yes, 100% yes. Look at all these home accents. Is this not like the most beautiful sight ever? So neutral, so pretty. I just am so in love. So this coffee table is part of the, I think the Chadwick collection. So this is 549. I love the like woven accent on the second level. I like the wood top as well. I feel like it's a little bit too like reddish orange for what we're going for. Not that I want like a gray wash or anything, but I just don't want anything that's like that warm but this is so beautiful so one of the things I wanted to come in for was to look for the banquette that we want to get so they don't have the banquette in store but this is the exact color and leg color that we were wanting and they have this here for me to see so this is just like a really really pretty like ivory color and then the legs oh gosh hang on the legs are this like neutrally but still warm color it's called dune on the west elm website so this is exactly the combo we were thinking of doing so i'm glad that i could at least see this in person oh my gosh i just love everything this like I don't, it's not a bar cart because it doesn't move it's just like a let's see what they call it tiered bar console it's absolute perfection i love all the different levels i love the gold but i still love how this has like the wood on top but i just love like the different levels i love how they have it decorated also this um wine holder is 
amazing this is 549 so things here are a little bit pricier but the quality is really good like these items are definitely going to last and you definitely might be seeing this in our dining room makeover just look at all these home accents like all of these vases or vases are so pretty the smaller one is 18 and then it just kind of goes up from there this one's 36 59 so honestly i would say it's maybe like 20 percent more or 20 to 20 to 40 20 to 30 percent more than what you're gonna pay at target especially for like the home accents but the quality is there like i really feel like they can back it with the quality they have this big basket for 160 at target something like this would be like 80 but i know that the quality is a lot better but this would be so nice for extra like throw pillows and throw blankets like in a living room i really really like this they have a lot of different sizes too so if you wanted to get like a set if you're trying to do maybe like open shelving like this and you want some more like hidden storage they have a lot of different basket sizes look at this massive decorative bowl so cool it's that's three of them there so this is the thickness of it so pretty these kitchen chairs are so cool so they are rope woven on the bottom and then metal at the top they're called the holland chair so this is the holland dining chair but it comes in a counter stool and we are wanting to do black counter stools so this could definitely be a contender these are 449 for the counter stools but they have sales a lot here too so keep that in mind this is the beauty is in the details and the quality and they definitely have both so actually the dining table that was right there with that chair they have in a coffee table version and i really love the coffee table version i love how it's still natural but it has those really clean lines so this is called the anton solid wood collection and the rectangle coffee table is 449 so it's going to be right around 500 dollars. but this is such good quality this is made out of solid mango wood and they do have a couple different finishes that you can get it in if you don't like the brown they always have like matching stuff too so they have a side table that matches and you can get the dining table too if you want the full collection like i mentioned they do have sales so a lot of items on this table are on sale and then right now they're having 30 percent off of the row blankets this is just such a good place to come it's definitely a little bit more expensive but they have really really great items if you do come to west elm you also need to check out their final sale rack so they'll have like a bunch of different like decor some like lighting things that people return they have a fake plant for like really really good prices so maybe you could find something on here and then my favorite thing that you definitely have to look for is this i'm kind of a big deal board because these are furniture pieces that people have returned that you can get for super good prices so they have like dressers, they have tons of bar stools, sadly none of the ones that we want. They also have like dining chairs, media consoles, like this is originally almost $1,200 and they have it for $9.19. Tons of rugs too, so like the Leora rug, um, this slub sweater rug which is super nice, 5x8. I think I'm going to go over and try to take a peek at that one because it's only $160. This glimmer rug. So definitely come over here. All you have to do is just pull it off, take it up to the front, and you can take it home with you today. Okay, this is a really cool wall too. They have tons of pendants. So I like how you can come and see them in store because we're wanting to add these above our kitchen island. So let's take a look at some of these. But I think we're gonna go something like pretty basic. So if you can see like these big round globe ones, I think we want something like that, but with black hardware. I would be down to do something a little bit different, but I think we're gonna stick with something that like will go with a lot of different styles for many years. They do have it in a little bit of a smaller version right here. I know it's hard to see because it's so far away, but they have brass, um, chrome, and black in all of their lighting. This store is honestly just beautiful. I definitely have to come back with Brian. Um, I definitely think that we're probably going to get those black globe lights because um, we like those a lot. Ooh, I just spotted something else. Hang on. So these are really cool. These are the same globes I was looking at up at the front, but in black, which is different. So these are $2.59 a piece. I like how 
they're just different but i like how they're black but i think them in black looks a little bit too industrial for my taste if you're ever looking for like wedding gifts this is a really great store to come to as well they have tons of like really beautiful trays and so many things that match it like these little bowls these are like solid marble bowls with these gold rims these are 22 dollars. these would be perfect to go along with a board like this or like a cake stand like that which is part of the collection um or even the one that it's on they have lots of different like shapes so this is a great place to register for your wedding or to come to buy a wedding gift this collection is super pretty and this is actually 20 percent off so the side table is 2.99 and then this console table right behind it is 4.99 but 20 percent off that price you can look out for really similar clearance stickers on tons of the items around here which i really love i will say though the just all the stores the shipping times are so crazy so you can always come in and try to buy it in the store which i think is really cool i feel like they have a decent amount of stock in the back but yeah i definitely need to come back here with brian again as far as like registering they have like so many beautiful like bar cart items that are great to register for glassware that gold shaker is so pretty really really nice glassware and then like tons of dishware so perfect thing to register for the lighting fixtures they have in here are really really different as well this one is so interesting i've never seen one like it before it's kind of like three different like rainbow arches kind of all going over each other so this is 359 so beautiful also i love how the gold color is not like very yellow it's more of like a champagne -y, subtle neutral gold that i feel like would go with a lot of different people's decor but like just like let's just take it in this is beautiful okay so that was the most fun and the people in there are so nice claudia if you see this she's one of the designers can't wait to like work with you and pick your brain about like design stuff because i definitely think we'll be buying several items from west Elm. Next, we are going to head to Home Goods and then Pottery Barn. I'm pretty nervous about Pottery Barn. I really hope I don't get kicked out. I hope the people in there are nice, but I've seen some TikTok stories um, where people in there are like not necessarily the friendliest, not, I mean, I shouldn't say that. That's not very nice for me to say, but I'm just nervous. I typically do not have any trouble filming in stores. People are normally like so open and welcoming to it, but you just never know. So I always ask when I go into a store for the first time, that wasn't my first time in West Elm, but I did just double check with them again. And they were like, oh my God, yeah, like so excited. So thank you to everyone in West Elm if you're seeing this, very hospitable. And I can't wait to come back and start purchasing everything. Next up though, home goods. I will just always be a home goods girly to my core, my favorite store. Besides for Target. Target's obviously my favorite store. Okay, first of all, these outdoor sets are really, really freaking nice. I love this one. I love how the chairs rock. I love the table and like the tabletop of it. Oh my gosh, wait, that's so nice. Then they have this like pink set and then down here they have this one, which looks a lot like Threshold or like Opal House, super nice. No price on here though, but it does come with two different tables and two chairs. Really nice sets. Oh my god, I haven't been to this home goods in a while and they added this whole part as furniture. This used to be lamps. Holy moly. Also, oh my god, to this couch. It looks like an RH, like Restoration Hardware Cloud Couch. This is so nice. I love the color, but like with the dogs, we could never. This is a pure linen upholstered sofa for $5,000. This might be the most expensive thing I've ever seen at Home Goods, honestly. They also have this gray couch, which is definitely more of like a like basket weave fabric, but this one's so soft. This one's so beautiful. So like most expensive item I've ever seen at Home Goods and one of the most beautiful. They have so much furniture right now. Lots of really great like dining chairs accent chairs look at all this look at this home goods is literally bursting at the seams i really like this black woven table it has the glass on top which is super nice oh it's on sale for 129 okay i really like this i feel like this could be really cool for our new coffee table downstairs because we are wanting something more black but I really like the texture on here and that's a good price. Oh my gosh, I, I there's so many good things. This console table is really nice, could be really nice for behind the couch because we didn't end up getting the one that I showed in a recent video. This one's 179, but I think it would be way too tall for the back of the couch and I want something that goes a little bit below the couch if that makes sense. But wow, this one's so nice. I love the wood. 
like the black it's just super super nice but still feels really earthy because you can see the grain of the wood underneath this is so nice it's definitely a good length for the back of the couch too oh, if only i could just like cut those legs off i like already have a hard time pulling the trigger like buying stuff and definitely without brian because he does want to be a part of it so we do have like kind of a shopping day plan tomorrow that we're not filming it's kind of like a mirrored day of this till i come back and look at this stuff hopefully it's still here if not it's my own thing because you guys know with home goods buy now decide later and don't regret it if you don't and it's gone because you can always return stuff but if you don't buy the day you see it good chances it won't be here the next day so i leave you with that this is a gorgeous console table super like modern sleek it's 249 so it's glass on the bottom they have like a protective thing over it and then on the top it's like this really beautiful like glass acrylic type I don't know exactly what that material would be called and it has brass all the way around super nice this could be like a console table you could do it as an entryway table you could do it as like a little bar table super good table lots of uses for it but just not our style but super nice and i know some of you guys love this style i feel like this home goods trip is like decently successful but like because i'm like too scared to actually buy anything without brian being here maybe it's not i don't know home goods is always fun like even if you do or don't end up buying anything so home goods is always a fun time i hope you guys don't get sick of seeing home goods because there's so many different stores and they all have different stuff like i said before so definitely gonna be a lot of home goods showing up on my channel over the next few months as if there was ever like a lag in it but now we are going to head to pottery barn wish me luck okay i'm at pottery barn now which is in the mall so it's super loud but like oh it's looking good already also this is like my dream bed the bed with the four posts okay let's go in look at this beautiful bed i love the four post bed i think they're stunning i want to get one for brian and i so eventually in a master bedroom makeover i want to make this mine oh they have some easter decor Look how cute. Not why we came here today, but I didn't even know they had this. Just like West Elm, they have a lot of home accents. This vase is really, really pretty. It's like a black woven vase. This is 129. Okay, I got my fabric samples. We'll talk about them in the car. But I wanted to show you that they have a sale section in here as well. So these are floor models. So they have like this cute couch, this really nice chair. This is originally $12.99 floor model sale for $6.49, so half off. They have this console table, which is $1,099 floor model sale for $700. Also this like bookshelf type item and a coffee table. 50% off. I'm honestly really interested in that console table for the loft. I just sent a video of it to Brian. It's just really, really nice, and the size is big, and our loft is big, so we need big furniture. <gasps> I'm like, I'm like so scared to pull the trigger on anything. This dining table is also stunning. I'm sorry about the lighting in here, but this is the same sea drift like legs we were thinking about doing the banquette in. Um, he was like showing me all the colors and everything, and this is the Toscana dining table. It is just, it's just so nice. Okay, so as you can see, Pottery Barn went pretty well. I'm not really sure that they were that cool with me filming in there. Someone saw me filming in there and then was like kind of staring at me and then he was like helping me. Um, but I did, so they didn't really say I like could or couldn't, so I just kind of like filmed what I could. Um, but I did get swatches for our dining banquette. Um, so I got five different ones. I got a lot of the performance fabrics are the ones that I wanted to look at because it is going to be like a dining bench. So I want it to be a performance fabric. That's a lot easier to clean. So let me show you these really quick. Okay. So here are the five that I picked up the gray one. He like gave me at the end just to feel, but I'm not really considering gray. I'm considering all of these beautiful ivory ones. These are all like different. This one's my favorite. This is a performance Chateau basket weave in ivory. It feels really, really durable. They said that it cleans really well. So this is the one that I'm leaning towards. Here is the Performance Heathered Tweed in Ivory. This one's really nice too. This one's like a little bit softer. So that's an option. This is another basket weave, but this one's not performance. So I definitely am not going to get anything that's not the performance fabric. Just for like longevity sake, if that makes sense. Here's another one. This is the performance brush basket weave in ivory. So this is a brushed and then this one's not. So tons of options. These are so fun. Pottery Barn is such a nice store. I honestly, again, had such a good experience. I'm really excited to go back. Brian and I are going to go back tomorrow to look at that console table. So definitely make sure you're following me on Instagram at Katie Vining if you want to see like more in the moment updates or if we buy it you'll actually be seeing it like the same day that you're seeing this video if we decide to buy it i'll probably document it on instagram i know that me shopping at these more expensive stores it's not like 
they're really expensive like it's not even honestly that we could like afford to furnish our whole house but we are looking for some really good stable pieces that will last a long time and from stores like pottery barn west elm nicer stores like that the quality is just really really good and if something goes wrong the companies back their product so you can always like kind of figure out a solution get a replacement that sort of thing so i'll always be a home goods girly don't you worry um but i had a really good experience in pottery barn if you have pottery barn furniture or west elm furniture i would like love to hear your opinions down below um i do think i'll be shopping there a lot more i'm really like loving how you can buy the floor models same with like at west elm it's like pretty similar but i don't know i just think that's so cool because you can get those really nice pieces like yeah maybe they're like a little bit loved um but that's fine with me and they're just so much cheaper so might get that table make sure you're following me on instagram Instagram. All right, well that is today's shopping trip. Although I didn't end up like actually purchasing anything, my true mission was to go out and see stuff in person so that we could make final decisions. And now I feel like I have a lot more info to like buy these new pieces for our place, which is so exciting. I feel really good now that I have the swatches from Pottery Barn. I feel good now that I saw some of the lighting from West Elm. Just need to get Brian's stamp of approval so that he feels included and make sure that he loves everything as well. And yeah, we are well on our way to furnishing our new house. So thank you for coming shopping with me today for the new house. It was so much fun. I hope that you guys like these videos. Please Please be sure to let me know down below if you don't if you like these videos where I kind of shop around and show you what I'm thinking at like multiple stores or if you just want me to stick to one store video definitely be sure to let me know down below your feedback would be um, like really really helpful but that is gonna be it for me and I don't know I, I had a lot of fun today and I hope that you guys did too well alrighty you guys that is gonna be it for me I really hope that you enjoyed this pottery barn West Elm and home goods shop with me I know that I don't get to those high-end furniture stores as much but i really am hoping to shop there more often i just don't know if they like change their merchandise as much as obviously like a home goods does but in our new place we are trying to invest in quality furniture pieces that we plan to have for a really long time whereas in the apartment we bought items that look similar to the style we wanted but in prices that we could afford which is totally okay you're gonna have different phases of life and eventually you know you invest in that expensive furniture and that's kind of what we are hoping to do being in the new house i hope that you love this video i hope you've been loving the moving series if you have any other requests please be sure to leave them down below and be sure to let me know what was your favorite item i showed in today's video but that is going to be it for me if you haven't yet please be sure you gave the video a big thumbs up hit the subscribe button to join my little corner of the internet i'm dying to hit 50,000 subscribers and also be sure to hit the notification bell if you want to be notified every single time i post a new video on monday tuesday friday and saturday but that is going to be it for me. I love you all so much and I'll see you next time. Bye guys!